Hello and welcome everyone, my name is Bruce and in the following video I'll be giving you a guide on the mud charcoal furnace what it's used for and what you can also put inside of it to uh, start it up or to get it filled so you can light it up okay first of all unlocking the blueprint you can just unlock the blueprint by going down to the river any type of river and as soon as you get to the river you just press triangle and say you click on take mud as this will unlock most of the mud blueprints the, uh, after dropping the mud it will despawn there's nothing you can do about the you know just leaving it there on the ground it will just despawn okay now that you got the blueprint you want to get out the mud furnace so if you go into your notebook it'll be at the campfire uh, on the right side as you guys can see there and then you just keep on scrolling until you see a mud charcoal furnace okay now after that you want to get a suitable place to put this down so let me just see okay I'm sure I can put it down here which would be not too bad let's see there we go okay so I'm placing it down now if you go into the notebook this will say it needs three mud bricks this bird is annoying me now it needs four mud bricks uh, to be honest cuz yeah I'll show you guys in a second here why it needs four mud bricks okay let me just move two over so I can build it uh, just gonna take this by hand just like this okay I just want to take this meat off the rack quickly so I can put on more meat. And by the way, the best meat in the game is the tapper, uh, the tapper meat. Because you do get like six meat from one, which is good. Okay. Um, so I need one more. Yes. No, I do not need. Yeah, yeah I do. Sorry, I do. It's four. It's four in total. Okay. Now, getting the mud bricks, you can check a video just before this one. I'll show you a guide on the um, mud mixer. So, after that, you just want to place this all down. And I just want to chase these birds away as they are irritating me. They do make a lot of noise for some for some reason. There's one more. Now it's just gonna land up there. Oh. And anyway, so it sounds a bit quieter. Okay. Now that you got this, you need sticks. Uh, you can use one of three items. You can either use the small sticks. Okay, so I'm just gonna take max. You can use the normal, just other sticks. And you can also use planks. You can't use bamboo sticks. You can't put bamboo sticks inside of this furnace. Okay, so now, getting into inventory, you can pick up a full stack, as this will take uh, two big stacks, well, almost two uh, normal sticks uh, bundles, so it's about 20 of it, um, and then 10 small sticks, so I'm going to give you guys the exact number just now, uh, so yeah, I do have 10, luckily, okay, so if you go here, you can then from here on just type, because everything over will go in but you can't do anything about it okay so it uses 17 uh, sticks and 10 small sticks after that you're gonna need some kind of kindling you can use dry leaves or even get yourself birds nests in this case I'm gonna use dry leaves as I do have a lot more than just bird nests because bird nests there is only three in my bag okay so now after that you want to get your uh, fourth mud brick and you want to put this on that's why I say you need four mud bricks three is to build it and you're gonna need one mud brick every single time after uh, lighting the wall well, after packing it uh, you can need one mud brick but it's good I'll show you guys in a minute why I say that go into your backpack you want to get yourself your fire starter for this I'll be using the tribal fire starter but any fire type works or fire starter type works and now I'm gonna put this in my fire starter and light it up you can also use a torch uh, that's already lit and you can transfer the fire from a different one to this one 
Okay, now this will burn for a while. I would prefer having two of this up and running at the same time. As you're going to need a lot of campfire whenever you're trying to build yourself big structures like this. As you guys can see, it's, it's kind of a big structure. Um, I can even go on top and you can imagine the amount of mud I used to build this. Okay, and it only gives you four, well, one uh, campfire ash gives you six mud bricks, which is nice. Okay, and after that, this thing will burn. So light this before you go to bed or before you sleep in game, doesn't matter what you want to call it. And then when it's done, it'll say mud charcoal furnace and square to use. After that, you'll see there's 15 uh, charcoal pile inside. It's 15 out of 15. You can take the max and campfire ashes there will be three inside now you can fill this bad boy up and get it lit again now i'll show you guys how you can even get more campfire when you need uh the campfire ash as you guys can see i got three campfire ash that will be six whenever the other one burns out so it's six campfire ash in total if you have two but on one furnace it'll give you three charcoal uh, well 15 charcoal and 3 of the campfire ashes. Now, whenever you got the charcoal, you can always use the charcoal and you can harvest it as this will then give you one campfire ash. One charcoal will give you one campfire ash as you guys can see there. So, it's a pretty good way of uh, building in the game because um, you're going to need one campfire ash and this thing does take a while to burn. Uh, it takes... I'm pretty sure 12 in-game hours, if it's even that quick. But it does take a while to burn inside the game. And after that, you can just use it to get another brick. So I would prefer getting yourself a extra brick and just placing it next to each uh, charcoal furnace. And from there on, you can just fill it up and light it up. You can also use planks that you get from uh, the logs. They are a pretty good source. I think it's like three planks and then it's full but you also use planks for storage boxes so yeah as you guys can see this is the mud charcoal furnace guide uh, i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you want to see any specific guides in the game make sure to tell me in the comment section down below and i will make a video on it thank you guys for watching i hope you enjoyed this video and i'll see you in the next one have a nice day